Hey, 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 y'all, what's up? Welcome to my channel, T Girl Magic Tarot. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Here to do a reading for my jet jet child. I literally just opened up my eyes. <laughs> jet 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 jet. collective what's going on y'all oh my gosh i hope you guys woke up on the good side of things okay maybe remember your energy when you wake up in the morning and you feel some kind of way okay if you feel a little afraid or even a little imbalanced or there's some fear or doubt or your emotions are all over the place like you went to bed in a good mood but you woke up kind of eh, eh. oh let me okay let me do this first thank you thank you thank you thank you for your love your comments your subscribes your donations your continued support I'll be beginning your readings out, okay? They will be going out those in, in order, okay? So we do have a 4872 delivery, hour delivery time. In most cases, you'll get it a little sooner. And then if you want a same-day reading, um, you'll get that within 24 hours. I changed the timing on that one because it's a lot of you guys um, requesting readings, okay, baby? And so we'll get those done for you, and I'm sending you love and light. And just FYI... I have permission from the ancestors if you reach out to me and get a reading. No, I don't read you. But I ask the ancestors, do I have permission or is it okay or safe for me to do a reading for you? Because there's so many different frequencies and everybody's on different pages and going through their healing journey, okay? Um, if I'm able to do a reading for you. I'll, and they'll tell me yes or no. And they'll tell me why I can do it or I can't do it. If I can do it, they'll give me a whole bunch of good you know, thumbs up, six of wands, empress, like, yay, yay, do them, okay, they're on their healing journey, and then the other ones that give me no, honey, we will get all kind of tower cards, and devils, and low vibrational, and nine of swords, and two of so child, it's a no, okay, so I, I'm not able to until you raise your vibrations a little bit, you could probably go to a other reader, I hope they do a reading before they take in that energy now because there's some healing to be done. Okay, baby? I, I love you. No pun intended for those that have reached out and I have not reached back out. Um, as far as a reading is concerned, well, it's, it's, a, it's, a, it's, it's a no. Okay? Depending on how bad the energy is. Now, if it's okay and you're kind of like, there's things around you that are just attached to you. I'll email you back and let you know why I'm not able. So regardless, I'll let you know why, okay? Uh, why I can or cannot do it, okay, baby? So anyway, choir, come, 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 come. One, two, three, oh! T-girl, T-girl, magic and collective. T-girl, 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 magic and collective. T-girl, T-girl, magic and collective. Check this out and see what we're about. Ooh, we are Gemini, 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 Gemini. Gemini, we sing Gemini, 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 we are Gemini, 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 Raise the vibes, yay. Okay, Gemini, let's get into it. Um, Some of y'all are... This is a full moon energy, okay? So I don't know, baby. You done walked away for something. Let me see how I feel and how you're feeling right now. Oh, you like that? Gemini, somebody is sad and afraid. It could be an interracial couple. It could be a same-sex couple. It doesn't matter. Someone's all in their emotions. Some of them are so angry and sad. They're howling at the moon. Now, um... They could be dark. I don't know, baby, but I'm getting that you walked away to go be happy. You dropped a burden down or somebody's literally all in their emotions because you don't want a new beginning with someone and you do not want to move forward with someone, period. Whoever this energy is in secret, howling at the moon or they're doing some type of moon magic, baby, and they're all in their damn head with anxiety. They're stressed out. They're having sleepless nights. They probably got a headache. Some of y'all waking up with a headache because somebody did moon magic on you trying to tap into your crown chakra. I just noticed this. You see this over here? Somebody's chakras are off because usually this is like nice and aligned and stuff. And I didn't realize that. I was like, oh, somebody's chakras are off. Their heart chakra is off. Their solar plex, their sacral, and their root is off. 
maybe their crown, their crown is kind of tilted and jilted and their throat chakra is working. It's, it's over, it's over. I'm hearing they're overdoing their throat chakra or something like that. Somebody's off balance, baby. Okay, it could be you being off balance, but I'm feeling that this other energy is off balance because they cannot bring conflict and chaos into your life or your energy doing this moon magic. They're hangman, and that's making this, them feel this tower, and they feel stuck because they're not able to touch you, period, because you don't walked away from the relationship. You don't have any ties, emotional attachment, or none of that. Right now, you're in a high vibe energy. And I wasn't going to use these cards. I said, I mean, these ones. I said, Spirit, I don't want you. He's like, you don't tell us what you want. We got, look. And even as light workers, we do balance out the light and the dark. We have light and dark inside of us. Are we perfect? Absolutely not. But in the eyesight of God, because of our mission and our DNA and our heritage and linkings, <laughs> linkings, <laughs> who we're connected to. Okay. Um, so that's why, you know, you're favored. Okay. Because you stay high vibe. No matter what conflicts come your way, you know how to transmute that energy. And somebody said that they, you know how to transmute energy. Somebody tried to stop your new beginnings, doing some kind of SEX magic in the moon or whatever the case may be. And that shit was an epic fail. Okay, you're still walking away. So whoever is doing this energy, trying to call you in and bring you back and do all that, they stuck at a stagnated place. Now, um, I feel that either we're doing it by themselves or with a group. This group is devastated. Okay, now I need to know what this is, Spirit, because somebody is angry. I'm getting that energy of, 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 of maybe they can't get it up anymore and they have to think about you and the happy times that you had. They think they stuff. It's Because, mm, you know, men judge themselves, not all of them, but most of them do judge themselves by this wand and have the performance of the wand or the... You know, but this wand, honey, is limpy. Ooh, shit. Um, I feel like it's just not getting up. They have a lot of options that they can choose from, whoever this person is, but no, nothing compares to you. They put you on competition, and the competition is does not compare. They failed miserably. Some of them were doing group set. Child, what is going on over here, Lord? Um... I know this ain't no male. For some of you guys have a warlock in a male coven. They could be a cancer. They could be definitely heavy water sign with air. Okay, mental. Mental. They're in their head. They're men, they're 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 they overthinking something. I don't know, baby, but they're trying to figure out why the conflict and chaos magic isn't working. Yeah, they want dominion and control over you. I don't know. But oh, this is a side note away from this. Um you guys are sleeping good. That's what I'm getting, though. Some of you guys have had some wonderful rest, or you're sleeping good, and you're waking up refreshed. And I think this person can't, I don't know, they do something in your sleep where they think that you're, I don't know. But whatever you're doing, baby, you keep doing it because you wake up like this. <laughs> Yay! Yay, baby, keep waking up like that, okay? Somebody's in their head because they can't knock you down or they can't stop your happiness or they can't stop your nine of cups. I'm walking on sunshine. Wow. And it makes me feel good. That's what I'm hearing when I see this card. <laughs> That's what it is. You, know, you got good luck. The will keeps turning no matter what, baby. You're so protected by God, Yahweh, Elohim. And somebody is really sorrowful. Because they can't affect you because it's over. You know, kick somebody to the curb. You see? With her foot. Well, child, she's stepping on somebody's baby's back. Child, who was somebody stepping on the baby back? Some of y'all done kicked your kid. That's kid out. Okay, so some of y'all, y'all do have a child that's doing magic on you or they're stressed out or I don't know. Something with your child, this Prince of Cups energy. Okay, they done did some work on you or they did some work with somebody else and paid somebody and they thought it was going to be successful and they thought they were going to get a new beginning and a rebirth. Now, it doesn't have to be a child. It could be. So you take the energies wherever they go because I don't know your story, okay? I'm just telling you what's the energies on here and it's up to you to discern where you fit in or where you don't, okay? Yeah, they worked with some other people. So I get X energy. I'm getting a family energy, you just got several people, possibly five people in your energy, okay? I don't know who and where they are. They're, they're from everywhere, y'all, okay? 
And they thought they were going to get a new beginning and an ace of pentacles. They thought they were going to get a rebirth if they put in collaborations and went against you. There could have been three people or more, whatever, okay? They tried to change your past. They want to control over you. But hell no, when God says you are who you are and what you are, you are who you are and what you are, son and empress. Yes, you're meant to be single, self-sufficient, abundant, and independent. Okay, the empress could be married because, you know, we've got the empress and the emperor. But usually I feel like you could be a mother or you could just be a somebody that makes things grow or you reached some type of level. Wherever you are, this is who you are. You're shining and you're some type of superstar in your own right, possibly in the spiritual realm. Um, and somebody is all in their head because they cannot interfere. This is the Eight of Swords. This is mental entrapment. What does this say to interference? Somebody was trying to interfere with you mentally to keep you in some type of stagnant energy. Look, they done sent this shit out to you, to the Queen of Swords. But baby, like I said, you're too strong. I can't stop. I won't stop. Uh-uh, uh-uh. Can't nobody mess up your peace. Period. This is peace. This is the Two of Swords. This is mental clarity. Okay, your swords are up. Okay, you, you okay, 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 spirit. We can't go that far that deep right now because I gotta stay here, okay? Because whoever you are, your mind, okay, you're literally one with God or tapped in. You're God's happiness, God's baby, God got so much protection over you. You're meant to be self-sufficient, abundant, and single. For some of y'all, okay? Because everybody's not gonna get an emperor. A lot of times it's just a spiritual journey and a representation. God is everyone's true emperor. God is your true soulmate. That's why we're here to step into our divinity to get to know who we are as God is in us and he actually exists in light and or dark. You're the balance of both. You're the happiness, okay? You're born in sin, but you're not of sin, if that's making sense for those that are called and chosen, period, okay? Are we perfect? Like I said, absolutely not. But in God's eyesight, because of our position and our ranking and our our, our 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 mission you are perfect you're you're perfect for the mission that god wants you to do all the light is hidden within you or it's not depending on what you are okay or god hid someone's light from you oh no they hid your light from someone i said that backwards yeah baby you living in the life of lab, luxury or somebody yeah, you, okay, so you have to protect what's your future or your, your legacy or your inheritance or something like that. But the bottom line is people are upset and they're sad because they've been attacking you over and over and over again. They've teamed up with so many different people and they still can't take your ass down. And somebody that did so much too much to where they can't even function anymore properly on their genitalia. And that's sad, but... That makes a big deal because they've been doing so much in dark and secret with it. Okay, they've been misusing it or misappropriating with it. Look, see, these are all off. This is their lower region down here. See? And it's it's to the side or oh, this way. This to the side, you know, that means it's imbalanced. It needs to be lined up all the way. Okay? Um, and that's not happening. So, mm, oh well, I don't, we don't know what to say to that one. Yeah, they want dominion over you. Um, and yeah, they want this Ace of Pentacles from you. But they just can't take your Ace of Pentacles. That don't even make no sense. They better watch out because karma is real. I don't think they... Child, what is going on? Somebody... Ooh, what is that spirit? Okay. Somebody got lost. Maybe your name is Mary because I am... Because <laughs> I got my Lost Mary vape. The Banana Duo. Yes. But somebody is literally upset about your peace and your balance and they can't disturb your migratory track your spiritual migratory track they can't they can't stop nothing and somebody's finally realizing that you have put, laid them down to rest you've gathered your courage and your strength yeah somebody's trying to send a monitoring spirit listen to your animals your animals if they bark in and and being aggressive with other animals or insects and you're like why is little what is it i don't know what your dog name Whatever your animal name is and they kind of like barking at the air or barking at nothing or just going in the corner. with it, They're letting you know that there's some monitoring spirit around you. Okay. 
But don't, I mean, don't ever worry. You just got to be aware of your energy surroundings. Don't ever be afraid of it, okay? Some of these things make you guys afraid because you don't want to, you got to be, you got to go through something, baby. You're going to be attacked. The weapons will form, but they will never prosper. So you will feel the effects of whatever the enemy is doing. And it's only for your benefit and your gain for you to get some type of rebirth, okay? <sighs> yeah. So you, so you can find balance and learn your, your spiritual gifts, but you're learning them and you're using them and you're, you're, you're successful. This is necessary for your rebirth, okay? And to make you stronger, okay? I, I don't know why I'm hearing that song with Kanye West, that, that, that don't kill me makes me stronger. What's that song? Wiser, faster, stronger. That, 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 that I need you right now. So I don't know. I can't give it all in my head right now. But that song is coming from, that's like a, I don't know. What doesn't kill you makes you stronger, Gemini. Okay, so don't be no punk. And God needs soldiers on his team. He don't need no weakling warriors. Okay, he wants victorious and successful people. Okay, because he is the overcomer and the conqueror. That just shows what's dwelling and what spirit and what you're made of. Okay, but yeah, somebody said that you done kicked him out. Either your child is sad or the baby is sad or <laughs> uh, this person acts like a child. Okay, and you're not able to deal with that. You just want peace in your life. This person is an interference and they don't help you grow. The only way you grew is when you kick this person to the curb. Okay, you kicked him out of your force field or your energetic field and you got the downloads from God. He's like, this person's a problem. Okay, you need to gather some courage and strength to end the situation with this individual and have a rebirth. Okay, for in order for me to work with you, with this three of pentacles, to make you self-sufficient, abundant, single, balanced out with this son, you need to walk away to step into this emperor or empress energy. Yeah, there's going to be people that are sor sorrowful and sad but that ain't got shit to do with you. You moving forward with this wheel of fortune, honey. Okay, and people are afraid or I don't know. They what's what's the, what they they because you're about to get this ace. This is your destiny. Okay, you're supposed to get an ace of pentacles. You're supposed to be moving forward. Some of y'all about to get a brand new whore. Yes. Okay. So if you apply for a loan and you will work, so if you move in the right way, God will bless you. Because some of y'all going to take that same damn car and not use it or go where you need to go or something like that. Or you're not something, okay? And you're going to be disappointed that you did not get approved for that car, okay? Because why, spirit? Because you're being petty or something like that? You know, God sees everything. He sees your attitude. He sees your thoughts. He sees your, vibrance, uh, your vibration. And if you're not operating in that certain form or fashion... You may not get it. And if you do get it, you won't keep it or you're not allowed to keep it or he'll take it away. You're always going to be going through some type of death and never a rebirth because you're refusing to put in the work and do the things that you need to do. You have too much sorrow in your heart and you're all sad over this empress because they're happy or they're the son or they're tapped in and connected to God and God favors this person. And they listen to the downloads of their angels and Holy Spirit they walked away from your ass. I don't know who I'm talking to. It's not high vibe. I know that. Okay, it's a lower vibrational. And that's okay, baby. You're here to learn, heal, grow, and evolve. But you need to grow up a little bit. And you need to put in some work. You can't have somebody else doing all the work for you. Why is this person so... They want Gemini. I don't know. This person's hateful. Whoever you left behind, it doesn't matter who you, they are. Family, friend, foe, neighbor, whoever. They want to ruin you because they don't like your light. Your light irritates their demons, okay? It really does. So God had to, God saw, God saw what they were doing behind the scenes with other people to get a rebirth on you. And God said, I don't think the fuck not. No, it's a no-no, okay? Yeah, look, it could be a Capricorn involved, but these people, whoever they are, they're chained and bounded together. They're bound to the devil in a contract. Okay, misery loves company. They burn. They they des they destination is fire. Yahweh Elohim is a consuming fire in Timothy. Okay, um. So at the end of the day, God is heaven and He's hell at the same dang time. 
It just depends on what, what energy you're operating in. If you're operating in this low vibrational, doing magic against people, trying to invade in their, invade in their free will, you will get burnt and touched by the sun. Fire doesn't burn fire. God is fire. So if you have the Holy Spirit, which is a charging spirit, child, you ain't going to hell. Shit, you all you all actually are the hell or the walking karma or you're the punishment. You're something. You set people on fire, you get their fucking bridges, you get their 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 you you really chap their hide. Remember that Pace Picanti commercial back in the day? Hey, Cookie, that really is Pace Picani. They're like, who is that? What is this? If you didn't bring in Pace Picani, they you would have a problem, baby. Okay? And the whole clown would go after you if you didn't bring in no Pace motherfucking Picanti. But anyway, these people are literally going through some type of karma. The scales need to be balanced because of all this dark magic. Some of them have offset or they did something that changes the world or the weather or whatever the case may be and they're in regret because you can't change god's balance if you start fucking with god's balance there's going to be a tower to your life you may be thinking you're getting away with it but baby you're never getting away with nothing no you're not okay queen of wands there could be a fire sign involved in this yeah hierophant yeah she's a motherfucking uh high priestess energy or it could be a warlock whatever they going through karma baby because they don't went down the wrong path trying to control god's purpose and his will and to try to block your ace of pentacles and ten of swords your ass with a king of swords and then this king of Pen yeah i don't know i don't know if they was together hooking up i don't know who is this king who is the person that's hanging out with this king of swords that's trying to stop gemini who what are they and who are they Gemini, it's a Gemini, somebody that's doing magic together. Okay, they doing magic together. And they feeling like a damn fool right now because you're stronger than them. You're tapped into God. I mean, that is your pretty much defense. You can't get over God, period. Like, you're going to get burnt, clapped, and crunched in every single way. No matter who you work with, no matter who you think is the highest, the baddest magician, God is the master magician. These people are little, spirits say they a hell of a lot of slow. That's why they shit is fucked up, okay? That's why they shit is dragging and hanging and they can't get it up no more. <laughs> and you still moving on to happiness. I'm walking on sunshine. Wow. And it makes me feel good. And somebody is angry or sad or they can't sleep because you still walking on sunshine. Okay. And you still happy, self-sufficient, and abundant. And now they all of a sudden have this love for you. I really think this person has a love-hate relationship for you, or these people do, from your past. They're having nostalgic memories and feelings. So what I feel is they attacking you because they're weird. And that's number one. And they're attacking you because so, there's a... There's, and I know there, it's not love. Just don't, don't give me, in their mind, they feel that they love you. They can't control you. You're moving on. And I think that they've done something in secret with somebody else that they're trying to hide in secret that they're afraid of. They put you in some type of conflict and chaos and they know something's ended with them, but they hope you don't find out, but you already know with this moon and high priestess energy. Because you're tapped in. You get downloads. Ain't nobody got to do nothing in front of your face. The spirit automatically lets you know. Period. Anything that's going on in your energetic field. And that's why they're sad about it. And they're fighting amongst each other now. And they're upset because you're still moving forward in success. And you got this air sign, water sign, or either child or lover, ex-lover, whatever the case may be. They want to come and make some type of apology to you. Because they, mm, they feel like if they can get with you, they can get it up again for some of them. Because you make them happy or they're, it's all the work that they've done that's ricocheting back to them. Okay, they wanted an ending for you. Yep, the Hierophant. They could be a Hierophant. They could be a Taurus, a Capricorn, Virgo. They could have signed some type of contract. But this is over. This is completion. It's, the cycle is completed. And somebody's trying to prevent a cycle from being completed. But it's too late because you've already had some type of rebirth. And this is not your only rebirth. You're rebirthing daily. You're dying daily to have a rebirth daily. Okay? 
Some of you guys are pregnant. Congratulations. Oh, yeah. Some of y'all are sad about this pregnancy. Lord have mercy. Did an earth sign get pregnant and she sad or they sad because they're single and somebody left them out? Oh, so I don't know if they were working. Oh, like, this is different. There could be somebody that they got pregnant and left out in the cold and they're sad and... Okay, I'm going to say how I feel. There's somebody in your energy that cheated on you, possibly with a family, a friend, or something that they did in secret. They were doing magic on you to cause some type of death, but all that did was send you to a rebirth because you're too strong, because you're too protected by Yahweh Elohim. These, this man or this woman is in regret that they ever went up against you to work with whoever they work with, this earth sign or this water sign or this air sign. Somebody got pregnant and left out in the dust, honey, okay? Yeah, so they were probably doing sex magic with each other or something like that, and somebody got pregnant, and they like, I'm not even trying to do it like that. I'm not even trying to keep you like that. I'm just fucking you. Ooh, damn. And so somebody left somebody, so somebody, mm-mm, Gemini. So whoever this other person is or this woman, they realize and they got, mm, they took, took somebody's trash. They done took out the trash, Gemini. Or something like that. Or they tried to take something from you but ended up taking your trash. <laughs> your garbage. Mm -hmm. I heard they're garbage. Whoever this magician or whoever this Scorpio or water sign is, they are garbage. And then they can't even get it up. And your person's upset because they still can't get it up. And that's why he got angry because he didn't even do it like that. Or he wasn't trying to do it like that. Well, you should have did it anyway, sir or ma'am. Shit. Now, somebody over here burning, possibly, this magician is burning, or somebody, they want, they went to go work with somebody, trying to be single and shit like that, and they thought they was going to get away and be happy, and child, they got burnt. I don't know. They, that's what you get for sleeping around, and especially unprotected. You get exactly what you deserve, okay? You need to move with cool, with structure, with class. Elegance is learned. Money can't buy you class, Okay? So this person want to come off like she, oh, I'm so classy and I'm so, I'm so debonair. Like weird and shit like that. But she's a trashy, hoary, ooh, damn, spirit, that's pretty vulgar. This person is, mm-mm. This person think they look good. They always like to have their stomach or their shoulders or their titties out or something like that. They always looking on, looking for the next proud. Now, this, this person look like an empress. So if you got a homegirl, homeboy, auntie, Sister, cousin, whoever, um, they think there's really, I mean, they probably, mm -hmm. spirit, they're very manipulative though. Somebody would put you in competition or somebody felt that they were better than you. Yeah, this person got left out in the cold. Somebody got them pregnant or knocked up and now they left out in the cold and, and now somebody going through a tower because somebody trying to keep you, ooh. Somebody got pregnant, and that's what they on hold. Please hold. <laughs> Please hold. Yeah, somebody done did some shit in secret. Somebody got pregnant or somebody pregnant and walked away because they really want to come to you. They ghosted the bitch. It was a one-night stand. Yeah, they like, oh, my God, what do I do? What had a, a Gemini? So there's a Gemini that was under an illusion or they were drinking late at night or they came together for drinks or a celebration, had a one-night stand, and then ghosted the bitch. The bitch ended up pregnant. Somebody ended up walking away, so that's the ghosting. Mm -hmm. And now there's a tower because they're stuck with this baby or something like that, and that's their karma, period. Because they were trying to... I'm telling you, it was given and taken, given to somebody else, and that's what changed the damn wheel. Okay? That's a faded event. So don't feel bad, yeah, for you to get pregnant and knocked up and left behind. So somebody's embarrassed now. They embarrassed. or Yeah, because whoever they had you in competition with, I don't know. This per Oh, this person is really stressed out, though. I don't feel, I don't know. I feel like this other person thought they could really take your man or something like that or take your person, but that was really never your person if they were to able if they were to be swindled and swooned to the side with manipulation. That's not, yeah, you don't want shit to do with that. That's why you ended up walking away into your happiness. You're like, bitch, you can have that. <laughs> and now this bitch is sorrowful because she was three of pentacling 
and trying to hop on the wand and shit. And that changed the fate of everything. And she still got left. And your person still want to come to you with this poisonous ass cup offer. Watch out because somebody done got somebody got like Bamba. And I think for some of y'all, your person was such an HOE not to be mean or nothing like that. Or somebody put a love spell on them so they can get, couldn't get it up for any. I don't know. This is going weird. But they did some type of sex magic. And I'm telling you, I don't know who had what or who was the carrier of whatever had happened. But this not, did not end out how they thought it was going to end out. Okay, so damn. And they somebody, like I said, they still walked away from the whole situation. Still got pregnant, still got left. The person still coming towards this other empress. Okay, because they went with them. They, look, I don't know what this means. Do they, so they invested in a one-night stand or they see what this person did or I don't know. I feel like both people are slow. Regardless of the situation, they slow. You got a jealous, slow person that use their body. You know, to get to get gains or something like that. They think they're they're very over highly sexual, and it's been revealed about this person what they did. So I don't, I don't know if your air sign person or your water sign person or whoever, if they really realize they finally realized exactly what was going on, or there wasn't there wasn't there was something not right about this empress, and they ended up walking away with the eight of cups. Yeah. Um, yeah, uh, this, mm. so I don't know if your friend or whoever was doing magic on your masculine, but that don't even matter. Your masculine need to be stronger, shit, all this, all this mental, mental anguish because they walked away from you to go make a love offer to a raggedy stank ass. I'm telling you, yeah, they ghosted you to go have a little one night passion it. You know, with um, the friend. They was looking for your friend. They turned their back. Well, I don't know. This look like this. They they offered their love to this one night stand. And that's why they ghosted your ass. But you knew because you were having... This is part of your spiritual development or your spiritual awakening or your spiritual ascension for you to move forward. Okay? In your life and take action to leave. But this person, I don't know. They was looking for a one night stand. They made this poisonous... Somebody was poisoned, so I don't know if a fire sign was poisoned or the water sign was poisoned, but somebody didn't do no research. When they went down there, they should have saw the bumps and the pops and shit, okay? Do your examination, do your testing. Don't just look because somebody looks good, you know what I mean? Got their stomach and body parts hanging out. That don't mean shit, okay? You need to dig deep and look before it take, look before your ass leap, okay? Maybe this person likes to do it with, they do it with the, the, Child, they have the lights off. Or
because God sees all. Okay, and you about to, yeah. And this person now sees that you were actually their sunshine and their real empress. And by them leaving you and the way they left you, you got some type of gain. And now you in this nine of pentacles energy with this good luck and success. And you're about to get another level up. And I feel like because of your strength, okay, because of your strength and your tenacity, your willingness to forgive and not hold grudges. But like I said, it's not like it didn't hurt, but I feel like it doesn't hurt you. You know it. You're like, oh, well, whatever. I mean, you took out the trash. It is what it is. Because they got the short end of the stick and not you. You got the up end. You, 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 you got success. I'm all the way up and nothing can stop me. And yeah, because you took a leap of faith. You trust your ancestors. You trust God. You listen to your intuition. Okay? And you drop the burdens. Even though you did it in secret or maybe you were afraid or I don't know. But you made it through a tower, baby, with this Gemini or you made it through Gemini. But yeah, somebody, it is an air sign that celebrated with a friend, a family member, somebody, baby, to keep you stuck and give you a tower. Look, see? But that didn't happen. I don't know. Something was illuminated that you too blessed and highly favored. You too balanced. You're too legit to quit, period, because you're God's child. God will never let anything happen to his babies. Yeah, you're going to have to go through something. You know, you let, you, you let your babies figure it out. You let them learn their own energies and their own gifts of what's, what they can do. And that's what God does you to let you know how strong you really are and who you really are and who's protecting and governing you. So don't ever be afraid of a challenge, baby. If this comes your way, don't be afraid, God. It will always end up like this. It may look like, oh, my God, they're going to come. No, and who cares? Take a leap of faith with God because God overcomes all obstacles and challenges. He fights all your battles for you. Not some, but all of them. So don't be no weakling. Don't be afraid when adversity comes because you're covered by Yahweh Elohim. Okay? So, Gemini, I'm going to end it right there. I love you. Um, Yeah. Look, somebody want to call you this raggedy-ass emperor. Now, I don't know. There could be an Aries that want to call you, a king of pentacles that's holding back from a queen of cups. For this offer. So who is this uh, Aries or Emperor energy? So I don't feel like it's this. I feel it's a new per child. What I'm feeling. Oh, you already know, Gemini. They're another high priestess or something like that. A king of pentacles. Um, it could be an earth sign. It could be a lot of people that want to reach out to you, baby. And marry you or ask you for your forgiveness. But there could be an Aries that wants to invest in you. And bring some type of balance. And possibly marry you. He got emotion. I don't know who this. This is a new. Jesus. Please don't say that. He's like. But it's true. <laughs> um, You have somebody else's. Okay. So I don't know. Mm, do you know the person spirit? Do, or just Gemini know. Mm, Gemini, somebody's all in their head. There's an emperor. Now, I don't know who this emperor is. I don't know if this, if it, because I did say whoever this earth sign or matriarch or whoever figure, they had a man or they had a choice between two. Okay, they ended up getting pregnant or something happened or something was illuminated about this empress with her body parts hanging out. I'm not, I'm not saying there's nothing wrong with body parts hanging out. Okay, it's a way to do it. It's a way to do it. Money can't buy your class, but elegance is learned, okay? Um, and this person doesn't have elegance. They look like they have elegance until they start manifesting and acting out how they really are, Jezebel-like, okay? Um, I'm going to say it. Whoever this Aries is, they want to take a leap of faith with you in secret. You don't know this? I don't know. I hope it's not this Queen of Pentacles Empress spouse. That's what Spirit is saying. This spouse want to, I don't know. That don't even make no sense. So does the other spouse want to get back at this empress or this queen of pentacles energy for cheating on them with some loser and getting burnt, clapped, and crunched? This gets deep, Lord. Oh, yeah. Somebody got backstabbed and betrayed this. Ooh, this queen of wands and backstabbed and betrayed this emperor or this Aries or fire sign. With her legs open. And that's why he was like, what? He feeling foolish. Judgment got called. Okay, he like, wait a minute. You know there's three people. So this could be her and then these other two people on the side that they child. That they was emotionally 
given to. Ooh, so somebody got exposed, baby. Yep. That their wife or their husband was a traveling hoe and what they were investing in in secret. There was a question of paternity, but we don't know. It's so funny that the, ooh, and this is sad because whoever this empress is, they already got a husband or they got somebody else and they're sleeping with two of them. And then the one that got them pregnant is the one that walked away from them. And then whoever this Aries is, they walked away from them too because of the mere fact. And they ended it. This Aries, look, this Aries was like, oh, bitch, you sitting on other wands and shit and you supposed to be mine. They saw it. They saw it because whoever this Capricorn or whoever this Earth sign or whoever, whoever it is, they thought they was getting away with something and doing something in secret about this backstabbing betrayal. But this other, yeah, child, I got to get out of here. But you already know, look, 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 look. See, she, she backstabbed and betrayed her husband because she thinks she looks so good. Yeah, she under judgment right now and got called the fuck out. So she could be emotional or trying to heal or whatever the case may be but that ain't got shit to do with you gemini you moving up or onward and closer to your dreams so yeah gemini that's all i got for you okay baby i love you have a wonderful day bye